What up folks and welcome back to Roma Serectum, the Persian Empire. We are playing, we are knocking these guys out. Oh, script done. Yeah, we are still at war with the Pontix. We gotta bring them to their knees and we are gonna stop the Seleucids from, you know, breathing and whatnot. I don't like that. I don't like it when they breathe. Uh, I'm not making crazy money. If I do start making crazy money, I want to make a big kick-ass horse army just like all horses but all like heavy cataphracts and heavy um, armored archers and stuff I just want to make a devastating horse army to just completely destroy the enemy uh, if the enemy has mostly uh, infantry units uh, fighting that kind of army with uh, uh, against pikes though that would be that would be a little difficult what are we um are we planning on doing anything new for this turn? It's been a little bit since I played this. Here we go. Yeah. Give me some happiness. Mm. Yeah, I'm happy enough. Expedition, yeah. Grain, yeah. Give me grain and give me happiness. Alright. Sounds good to me. <coughs> army over there we got Sire! Mm, this was the army of Nihavand now am I going to heal the army or did I already heal the army I don't remember it's been a little bit got this army are they healed they're healed so I think we should just uh, send you out military financial First aid, yeah. Now we don't need that right now. We have most of our media under our control. We just need like one more region, and we have all the Caucasus, all the Caucasus borders under the glorious control of a new Persia. Not possible, sire. Can we I do the that, money? Sire. Ah, yes. Gonna get trade and some map information from these Galaka. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, look at that. Every time the Galakai always conquer siege. North Africa, always conquer the Carthaginians. I don't like that. I don't like uh, the game always letting the Carthaginians get conquered by those Spaniards. That's kind of dumb. I wish I could send an army over there and help them. Mm, just stop that from happening. Uh, two turns until they're dead. Uh, let's get a fort built for you. There we go. We're just gonna march on to that city over there. What are we doing with you? Spear loving? No. Got high taxation. Oh, Governor's Palace. Yes, I want to build that. I do have the money for that. Oh no, they're attacking me. Stupids. Those stupids is are attacking me. Where were you going? Alright, head back over here, slaughter them. Got Parthians over here. We only have two real armies and a few garrison forces. We need more money so we can raise up more defensible armies. I'm lucky the Sarmatians and the Parthians aren't at war with me. Or that would be more borders I can't properly defend. Hmm. Pontix, they're going fine. Sire! Engage the enemy! No more moves. Sire. Oh, they're held by a good king. He's got Alexander's face from my little sub mod I put in. Is he a mm, no, he's just a family member, but he's a good general. But he's not an era Sire! king. Hunter! What the? Um, what else? I wanna keep making money, money, my money, money, money. I gotta keep making that money. The shrine of whatever. Yes, I'll make you. A temple complex. 
Let's try to build things that'll make me money for now. Alright, out of money. Nice, without even a drop of blood spilled. Settlement captured. Except all of their blood. I didn't lose any of my own. That's all that matters. Okay, stupid rebels keep messing around on my on my Sire. borders. Prepare for battle. Besieging settlement. I will uh settlement besiege it. Siege, How long? Six turns. When the enemy wants to attack me, they can attack me. In fact, no, I think I'm gonna use these guys. Forward. Forward. Yeah, they're gonna go over here and they're gonna take out these smaller armies for me. So I can uh, siege that place in peace. He is getting his own bit of glory. He is, what was he? He is the successor. It is Vashrama, wasn't it? Yes, he is the uh, general of that army. He is the son of the King of Kings, but he is not the heir. He is lesser than the stepson of the King of Kings. He has been made heir, and he does not like that. He wants to gain glory for himself because he wants to be the heir. He wants to become King of Kings himself. He must obtain greater glory than Nihavand. Than Zidaris. Mighty Zidaris. Forward, Will. Sire. Bring glory to this place. Um, what about you? What other? Um, March. Okay, we're gonna go. Yeah, I guess this way. We're gonna take. Yeah, I think my army's good enough to keep going. I don't think we need to heal right now. Still gotta get control of Damascus. Well, I guess they ran away. March. No more room, sire. Maybe I can send the small army out to try to take control of Damascus. That'll be good. I'll further get control of Damascus, all of Syria, all of Israel. Sire. Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh boy, this game's cool. I still, I've been playing Attila a lot lately because I just got it recently. I don't, you know, I don't know when I'm gonna upload this video, but as of a few days ago, I got Attila, and uh, it was. I still have so much fun playing this game, even after playing Attila, which is just great, a great modernization of the uh, barbarian era of Total War Rome. But this is just still so fun. I love playing. These uh, this, these Rome one mods. Man, for battle. This guy Glorious just. Orders, move out. Why don't you go back there? Moves, you go Lord. back to Antioch. Onward. These little rebel Mighty armies, are so annoying. March. Oh, Damascus rebelled. Cool. My I may be able to take advantage. March. Okay, I'm making some good money. Black smell, precious. Yeah, we want that. We want something else somewhere else. Mighty Vaughn is no longer the capital, but Antioch is. Because the King of Kings wanted to move his court there and have the new jewel of his empire be the capital partly as an insult to the uh... to the Seleucid dogs and these guys are still under control the Seleucids haven't tried to attack them, that's good okay they're still over there Sire. doing good March. Moves depleted, mighty lord. Attack! They got a lot of units, but they're all really uh, cut down. We could probably slaughter them with these Scythian horse, Scythian horse archers. Yeah, let's build some execution stuff.
We are going to eradicate those Pontics. Boy, oh boy. Oh man. Anyone else, uh, anyone else feel meh about Warhammer? I am kind Mighty of meh gentlemen. about Warhammer. Onward. Oh, that's a big army. Doesn't matter. Attack! Siege them out. And if they attack us, we'll destroy them. But yeah, I'm just not uh, excited about Warhammer. I'm not really into that. I'm not huge into the fantasy lore in the first place. I only like Elder Scrolls a lot. I know. I know. Warhammer stuff just doesn't grab me. But maybe the maybe the Total War game will change my mind. I mean, the Total War games are what made me fall in love with uh, history, ancient history and stuff. Science. So that might that might happen. It might make me fall in love with the Warhammer lore. Although there's not really that much Warhammer games to go around. I don't hear that much about them. I hear some about them, but not any, not any like huge, huge Warhammer games. I don't think. Uh, oh, they don't want to fight. Let's see, three generals, a couple of scary cavalry. All right, if we don't win, we can at least uh, empty our ammo into them and retreat the and retreat the cavalry. So that's what we're gonna do. See you on the battlefield. Hot dig a damn. This night we will feast and drink to celebrate victory. I promise you that. I also promise you the warm company of appreciative camp followers. But before any of that, there's something I'd like you to do for me. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, for the general, for the mighty garrison general. Yes, we're gonna crush. These little Send them bitches. to the afterlife! Send them to the afterlife! Uh-oh. Alright, where's the rest of you? Why don't you go over here? Uh, everybody's in skirmish mode, right? Yeah. Okay, run. I'm killing some of my own guys. Oh. You stupids. Run, 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 run. <laughs> run. Stupid fucking morons. Come on. Getting caught up on that bullshit. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh, that's what's happening, isn't it? Our guys are getting slaughtered. What's going on over here? Are we killing them? No? Of course not. Well, they are mostly heavy cavalry. I'm gonna be spending a lot of my ammo dealing with this heavy cavalry bullshit. Oh, fuck you. They got into my... Yeah, I underestimated their heavy fucking cavalry, didn't I? I underestimated their heavy cavalry. My guys are apparently not as fast as heavy. Which is nonsense. And the music's gone again. Because this uh, mod has a problem with music. Well, this is turning out to be a huge disaster, isn't it? This is turning out to be a massive disaster. Now my general unit is about to get fucked up. Where's the rest of them? Yeah, they're getting fucked up because they don't know how to run. And they're dead. Can I kill one of these stupid units at least? And of course he chased him all the way to the corner of the map and he doesn't... <laughs> He doesn't fucking know how to not be cornered into a into the map. So I have to babysit all these units to make sure they don't get cornered. Oh man, there they go. They're they're done. Oh 
Oh, you cocksuckers, run. The general shames himself and oh, your people. Of course he does. No excuses can be made for fleeing like this. Wow, what a disaster this was. For some reason I thought they would outrun the enemy, but no, they decided not to. Ah, oh, this was a failure of epic proportions. We can at least kill one of these general units. You fucking fucking morons. I told them to run away and they just let themselves get the shit kicked in. Just everybody run. Like the dumb little bitches you are. Come on. Look at this. What the fuck is wrong with you? I fucking told you to retreat. And you have skirmish on. Fucking shit. They're heavy cavalry. They should not be able to... Look at this shit. Run. They should not be able to catch him like that. Well, that was, a, that was a big mistake and a pain in the ass. Oh, I'm gonna have to re re raise that uh, that garrison force now. I didn't kill any of the generals, did I? I hardly killed any of them. I got a few kills in some of their units, but it wasn't enough. Yeah, it was my bad because I didn't build these armies, these horse archer armies for fighting units like this. I thought they were going to, you know, they were, the armies were small and tattered, so I thought my horse archers could handle it, but no, I fought, I fought these, I build these armies to face small little raiding armies that come and mess in my lands. And I forgot that. It's been a while since I played this and remember how uh, some of these units worked. But yeah, that was a mistake, I won't do that again. I'm just going to have to wait for the other army to siege the other, the settlement out. I have to rebuild that army to deal with small rebel armies and small incursions into my lands. Apparently heavy cavalry can chase down light horse archers very easily. Now you go there. Um, are you... Hmm, alright. Oh, shit. I don't know if that horse archer army can... can take Damascus. It might not be able to. Let's see. I made about $6,000 that turn. Oh, about seven. Now, this is my kind of army. They've got one Eastern General's Cavalry. Which, uh, hold on. I'm trying to get, there we go. There we go. Oh, he looks pretty cool. Alright, he, they've only got about one dangerous unit. That one, if I can take this one out, uh, I won't have any problems. Yeah, this, uh, I'm pretty sure this army can deal with that. Oh, no. Yeah, let's build a settlement, build a shrine, build you, let's build you, let's build you. Well, they, don't, they don't look very happy at all. Mm. Alright. Things look okay for the most, but where, where are you? Yeah, I got a few kills on some of these guys, but it wasn't enough. Just a few kills here and there. Mm. I'd rather let the siege out for a little bit. Da 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 da, come on. All right, another uneventful turn. No, nobody attacking me. That's just, just gravy. About two more turns until I can start sieging Damascus, but they're starting to fill themselves up. Oh, that's dangerous. Maybe the, maybe the King of Kings wants to join that fight. Um, wait. Mm, 
Um, doesn't, don't I have, uh, one of these units with, um... Yes, this guy. He's making 13,000 there. Minus 3,000 in Antioch. Be making more money if I had that uh, Antioch be Ivan as my capital. But King of King doesn't want that. It was Antioch. He is getting arrogant based on the victories of his stepson and they're acting as if they're his victories. In fact, this arrogance of his may drive him to do some uh, mistaken actions. Maybe he wants to join the uh, horse archers on the attack on Damascus. He ordered the attack on Damascus, maybe not fully understanding what a mistake that could be. Maybe it will be... Oh, they want ceasefire. No, no, sorry. You're the one who wanted this. <gasps> oh, no, they attacked me. This is just what I wanted. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we have a good, full, kick-ass army, and they have a bunch of tattered guys. We are gonna bring it to these guys hard, but we're gonna bring it to them next time. I'm your Graphics Rogue, and I will see you next time. Peace, folks.